It was a kind of a like ceremony at the Esteem Event Center GR Ebenicity, venue for the reception, organized in honor of late Eda Lucio Jaime by the children to celebrate their mother. <laughs> Children, relatives, friends, associates, and in laws of late Eda Lucy Ojeme included the parents of the granddaughter in law of the deceased, Mr. Charles Igbinejo, and his wife Angela, graced the event organized for guests who came from states of the country to celebrate late Eda Lucy Ojeme. <laughs> The former governor of Delta State, Chief James Sibori, and other personalities were on the ground to celebrate a woman described as virtuous and kind-hearted. In their various tributes, grandson of the deceased, Apostle Gordon Usagede Ada, General Overseer of Spirits and Life Family Bible Church, and others eulogized her. Mama was very generous with her words, very encouraging, never, never negative. It's such an amazing spirit to have. My mother-in-law was one of my greatest prayer warriors. The granddaughter-in-law of the deceased and her husband, Cleopatra and Igodaru Usagede, and others said she will be greatly missed. She embraced me so much. Anytime she sees me, she has a lot of love to give, a lot of care to give. She was such a, a bundle of joy and life and inspiration and encouragement. I mean, name it all. Grandma was everything to us. Wherever she is in heaven, of course, her prayers will still be going for her children. She loved us. She was grateful to God. She was a woman of patience, a caring mother, a woman who was so unassuming. She was survived by 10 children, include the founder of Jesus Women Prayer Band Ministry, late Apostle Deborah Eunice Gordon Usagede, 39 grandchildren and 49 great-grandchildren, late Eda Lucio Jaime, who hailed from Ekboma, a southwest local government area of Edo State, died at the age of 90. Deborah Ugbefun reporting.